One of the questions we occasionally get from non-farmers is our topic in our Farm Basics today, how long will grain last in storage? You know, Brian, this probably isn't a good question to ask farmers because most farmers would say, I don't know. Well, why would farmers not know they're storing grain every year? Well, one of the reasons why is grain is the farmer's paycheck and it's also their livestock's feed. So we're often growing just what we need for this year. We're gonna sell all the grain because we need the income or we're gonna use all the grain up because we need the feed. So many farmers have really never tested this beyond a year. All right, so here's one of the things I want you to think about. When you go to any store, pretty much everything you buy is dead. Okay, it's not really going to change much over time. But with grain, it's still alive. We often don't think about that, but if I've got soybeans or corn or wheat or any grain, that seed is alive. So we as farmers are trying to keep the seed alive as long as possible. If the seed dies, then there's more chance it's going to decay. And then we're going to get a dock at the elevator. We're not going to get as much out of this grain in terms of profit. So we want to try to keep that alive. All right, so grain will often be protected from the elements, like in a grain bin, for example, or under a tarp if it's piled up outside. But the two big things that you want to watch out for are temperature and humidity. If you've got a lot of high temperature conditions around that grain, it's just not going to survive very long. There's going to be bugs that get in there, and there's going to be mold or uh, anything that's going to lead to spoilage. That's just going to increase on you. And the same thing's true with humidity. If you've got just a ton of humidity in there and a ton of moisture, it's not going to store very well. So if we can keep grain cool and dry, it can store for a long time. Yes, so very often there are farmers who will store grain for years. Darren, you had a farmer you were working with who liked to store soybeans for many, many years. We don't typically advise that, but it can no, be done. It, it, it can be fine, but one of the tricks that he had was he had the soybeans very, very dry. Actually, uh, too dry for the processors. They didn't really like taking that dry a soybean, but when he kept them dry, he could keep them in the bin a long time and not have spoilage. So anyway, the whole point is think about seed as something that's alive because in most cases it is. Farmers are trying to keep it alive and they're trying to keep it from being damaged. The less damage there is, the more it's kept alive and the more it's kept dry and cool, the longer it can last, often several years. Farmers can store grain effectively without losing a lot, but typically grain is only stored for a few months and then it's sold. One of the things that farmers will do with that money when they sell the grain is purchase weed control options to stop our Weed of the Week. Can you identify this week's weed? 